today i am going to discuss about window air conditioner and this is the block diagram of the window air conditioner so welcome to my youtube channel mechanical engineering management at the end of this video you will be able to understand function location construction working model and limitations of window air conditioner so let's start with the function of window air conditioner and here you can see the different components of the window air conditioner it is used mainly for conditioning of air in the room next location commonly it is mounted in a window hence it is known as window air conditioner now objectives of the window air conditioner it is used to provide comfort cooling dehumidification filtering circulation of air ventilation means mixing of fresh air now the construction of the window air conditioner so this is a very important figure and same figure you can use in the examination it consists of the following components refrigeration unit and supporting unit basically there are three important cycles room air cycle hot air cycle and refrigeration cycle here you can see room air cycle and here you can see hot air cycle and third one refrigeration cycle with the yellow color you can see over here refrigerant cycle now next working of window air conditioner and here you can see this is the wall and so that this is the inside portion and this one is the outside portion the low pressure and low temperature refrigerant vapor from the evaporator is sucked by a compressor so here you can see the compressor and a low pressure and a low temperature vapor from the evaporator is sucked by the compressor the compressor compresses the vapor to high pressure and high temperature and discharges to the condenser so here you can see this one is the condenser in the condenser the refrigerant vapor condenses by dissipating heat to the cooling medium and that is generally air then it is converted into the liquid refrigerant by rejecting the latent heat to the atmosphere and then liquid refrigerant passes through the condenser filter dryer and capillary tube where it is again throttled back to the evaporated pressure then this low pressure low temperature liquid refrigerant flows to the evaporator this is actually evaporator coil with the filter where it boils off by extracting heat from the circulated room air that is exactly equivalent to the latent heat of the refrigerant next necessary fresh air is allowed to mix with the recirculated air to meet the ventilation requirement and ventilation air is controlled by ventilation damper the room temperature is controlled by thermostat which is required to on off power supply to the compressor motor more images to understand the window air conditioner so here you can see thermostat with the control system and this one is the grill for air inlet and this one is the grill for the air outlet so here you can see hot air in so this is the hot air in and then this one is the cool air out and here evaporator is there and back side condenser coils are there this one is the compressor more images 
here you can see the different components of the window air conditioner here you can see the same window air conditioner with a very simple block diagram this is actually inside and here you can see evaporator coil and this is outside that means outdoor with the condenser coil this one is the compressor now animation of the window air conditioner and here you can understand after compression this is the high pressure vapor refrigerant then it is passed through the condenser so that it is again converted into the liquid and then through the capillary tube or the expansion device it is once again back to the evaporated pressure then it is passed through the evaporator where once again it is converted from the liquid refrigerant to the gaseous refrigerant that means vapor refrigerant and again it is compressed and thus the cycle is repeated now advantages of the window air conditioner low cost easy to install energy efficient doesn't take up any floor space now disadvantages of window air conditioner the window where you install the air conditioner is blocked as long as the unit is there dripping water outside of window it produces noise in the room because of compressor is very near to the room if you want to see more engineering videos then subscribe my youtube channel and go to playlist thanks my dear friends press the like button to appreciate this video